of the Tape is sponsored by Good Luck Chuck in theater September 21st. Alessio Sakara, nine years younger than the American Houston Alexander. Alexander came in impressively at 203 pounds. Both have a reach of 72 inches. Sakara, 14.6 stone. Alexander, 14.5. To officially get UFC 75 underway, the veteran voice of the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, we are live from the O2 Arena in London, England for UFC 75. And now it's time to begin our first bout of the evening. Three rounds of fighting in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of seven wins with one loss. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 203 pounds, 14.5 stone. Fighting out of Omaha, Nebraska, Houston, the Assassin, Alexander! And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 15 wins with five losses and one no contest. Standing six feet tall, weighing in at 205 pounds, 14.6 stone, fighting out of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, Alessio Legionarios Sakara! And where the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Eve Loving. Eve Levine, our referee. The UFC is back in London for the first time since July of 2002 when we had the brawl at Royal Albert Hall. You ready, sir? You ready? Fight! UFC 75, champion versus champion, is underway. We're going to get a lot of answers about Houston Alexander right here. We're going to find out a lot. We're going to find out whether or not that was a fluke, that Keith Jardine fight. We know one thing. This is where Alexander likes things, inside. Alessio Sakara looks like he's looking to take Houston down. He's got a leg. And he's got it. Tries to pass, but he winds up losing it. The back of knee to knee. Alexander loves to use the knees. Loves to use that Muay Thai clinch. Set up the uppercuts like he did against Jardine. Utilize the knees as he tried to a moment ago. What I can guarantee you is Alessio's not going to make the mistake that Keith Jardine did and not respect the punching power of Houston Alexander. He saw what happened in that fight with Jardine. Oh, he got dropped. Rocks Alessio Sakara, and he has got impressive ground and pound with all that strength, Joe. Just teeing off on Legionarius. And it is all over! Houston Alexander is for real! Wow! Oh. You think he hits hard on his feet? You want to talk about some power? Houston Alexander just answered all the questions. That dude is violent! Stand in front of Houston Alexander. He will put, look at that mouse over Alessio Sakara's eye. Wow. That guy is for real. Houston Alexander, the winner. The official decision when we return on spot. He just answered a whole lot of questions from unknown to stopping two big names in the UFC in two fights. Here's some of the action. There's a big knee that rocked Alessio Sakara early. Alessio was fine there. He stood up. Bam! That's the one that dropped him. Loves the clinch, loves the knees, finishes it with ground and pound. Just stayed on top of him. A powerful guy. Landed bombs. Well, he was always taught, Joe, that the strength comes from inside. Inside meaning inside with a clinch or, you know, uppercuts and knees and showed us that again. Watch this. Bam! Beautiful knee. I like how he turned it over, too, from the outside and just stayed on top, relentless with the punches. Houston Alexander, very impressive. Well, there's another fight that doesn't last very long. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at one minute, one second of the very first round, declaring the winner by knockout, Houston, the assassin, Alexander. This Nebraska Cornhusker is a good fighter. Here's Joe. I'm here with Houston Alexander. Houston, 
Two fights in the UFC against top name competition, two big knockouts. I guess you answered the question, are you for real? Nebraska is in the building. I belong to the UFC. I want to thank my family, friends, especially my coaches. I want to thank the UFC. I want to thank the fans in London. All right, Houston, take a look at the big screen and talk us through the knockout. You heard him initially with this big knee. That's good coaching. <laughs> good coaching right there. Lots of determination and a lot of time in the gym. <sighs> wow. I love the fans out there. I love you guys, man. <sighs> wow. All right, Houston, you, you've only had two fights in the octagon, thrown immediately to the Lions. You've come out on top. What do you look for now? For anyone to get in the ring with me. I don't care who it is, any place, any time. I'm here in the octagon, wherever you're at. Well, very impressive victories. We look forward to seeing what's next. <sighs> Shouts out to all my sponsors, MMAJunkie.com. And what's next is anybody that gets in the ring with me. Houston Alexander, ladies and gentlemen. You know, Joe brought up a great point. Alexander's 2-0 in the UFC, and he's beaten Keith Jardine and Alessio Sakara.